Well guys, we made it to the top of Mount Zircon. I'm taking a breather, you know. Uh, oh, it, this hike kicked my ass, I'm not gonna lie. I'm out of shape, I've not been hiking in years. And uh, this was pretty brutal, you know, like five, six miles. You know, pretty steep, just about crawling some of the way. Supposedly there's some cool old mining stuff up here. Uh, Tom's gonna look around. We got a little bit of a geological survey that, uh, you know, shows where some of it might, it, it might be, but it's a little hard to tell where we are exactly on the map, so. But I just wanted to show this just amazing view. I mean, it is, it is truly a gorgeous view, you know, from the top of here. It's not a very tall mountain. What was it, 3,000 something feet, Tom? I can't remember. I'll have to look that up, but I think it was like 2,800, 3,200 feet. Not a very big mountain, but still, it's the steepness. How fast and how steep does it go up? That really makes it tough sometimes, but yeah, just want to show you guys. Want to show you we made it. Okay, we're back at the base of Mount Zircon. Uh, this is, uh, oh, behind me. This is uh, Zircon Road. Uh, the trail is really brutal for like a quarter mile back there. I mean, just steep, bouldery rocks that is just, just tough to go up on the dirt bikes. Um, but we made it. And um, Tom had to help me. I fell a couple times. Uh, but we got up. I think getting back down is going to be a little bit easier. But then again, it is starting to rain. There's some thunderstorms coming in maybe for the next hour. So I don't know. That may not be a lot of fun going down slippery boulders. But... You know, it is what it is. I didn't bring a GoPro to uh, actually film that on the bike, which kind of sucks. But um, but Tom's off somewhere looking around for, uh, you know, some of the mining stuff that's around here, I guess. There you go. Switch you back to the good cam. So, yeah, that's the trail that goes up Mount Zarkon. Uh It's like two miles. It's not bad for the first half. Second half is really steep. And um, definitely would have been trickier going up with the wet, slippery rocks that we were dealing with. But... Uh, coming back down, it wasn't too bad. It had just started to rain when we were about halfway out. Um, that way goes to a road. I just saw four four-wheelers coming that way, so I think we can get out that rain. But Tom doesn't have registration for the street, so we should go back this way, back through the bouldery bullshit of doom. Um, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, we'll probably go that way. But I'll try to maybe film it on my phone with my handlebar mount, but I'm not sure if I'm going to get a great angle. But I'm, I'll give it a try. We'll see. But uh, yeah, it's been an adventure. It's been a been a pretty physically demanding day, you know. Definitely, uh, you know, get a little rash on the shoulder from tipping over and scraping rocks. But uh, uh, my bike is not running that great. I definitely have the carburetor tuned a little too rich on the uh, low, slow jet, and uh, so uh, when you're doing really just slow technical stuff at a low RPM, it wants to be a little flooded and stall at idle. So that definitely added to the challenges. But uh, We'll see how it goes and where we goes, you know, from here.